Hi, this is James from OnlineITGuy.com, and we're talking about backing up your computer, or actually you're backing up your hard drive on your computer. Um, there's a lot of ways to back up your computer, and some ways are better than others, some are more expensive than others, and some are practical and some aren't really practical. Now, first look at something that's not really practical for backing up your hard drive is a flash drive de device, some type of uh, USB drive like this one, um, or maybe it's the digital memory from your, from your uh, digital camera. Um, these have the disadvantage, most of all, of being very expensive for the amount of information that you're going to get. Even nowadays, you know, an eight gig, uh, a four or eight gigabyte uh, flash drive is still going to cost you 10, 20, 30 bucks, and that's a lot for what you're going to get out of it. Uh, there is the other problem with flash drive is that if you read and write to it enough, it starts to get errors, it's, and that's not what you want to do for something to back up your most important memories. So. It's probably not a practical way to back up your hard drive, especially if your hard drive is 100 megabytes, you're going to need a whole lot of memory devices like this. Um, now, another way to back up small amounts of uh, really important information would be CD or DVD, or especially DVD, because CDs don't hold a whole lot of information. Um, but DVDs have the advantage that you can get DVDs with an expected lifespan of over 100 years. Um, most of us aren't going to be around in 100 years to worry about it, so it's a really good way to save the most important uh, in information that you want to save. They only hold about four gigabytes of memory. Now, Blu-ray is coming out, and that'll be a lot more space, but still it's a lot more expensive right now. So DVD is very inexpensive per gigabyte. I'm looking at like five cents a piece, or five cents a gigabyte, uh, when you can get DVDs for around 20 cents a piece if you look for them. Um, but it's not very practical for doing a large uh, amount of information, like a whole hard, hard drive that's 100 gigabytes. Again. You're going to need to burn 25 DVDs if you've got a 100 gigabyte hard drive, and that's going to take you hours, and that's something you want to do on a regular basis, and your files are going to change on your hard drive, so it's not a, the best way, but it's a great way to save those most important memories like pictures. You can save your, um, put when you can train, when you move your digital memory from your uh, camera to your computer, burn a DVD of those images right away, and put the DVD away somewhere where it's safe and won't get scratched, or burn two DVDs just in case one does get scratched and you can keep those memories around for a long time. So um, this is the first part. We'll be having some more on this series on how to back up your computer. Uh, make sure you check out my website at onlineitguy.com. Lots of good information for you on how to take care of your computer and keep your information safe.